Welcome to differentiation using the quotient rule. A reminder, as uh, we've discussed in other videos, that differentiation, the point of it is to find the gradient of a tangent to a curve at a particular point. So our rule for using differentiation with the quotient rule is if you're given one function divided by another, so that's what quotient stands for, division, then y dash becomes v u dash minus u v dash all over v squared. So we allow the numerator to be u and the denominator is v, and that's how we uh, get our formula. So let's have a look at some examples. So let's differentiate um, some uh, functions. 2x over x plus 1 and x plus 2 over x minus 3 squared. So as with the product rule, the suggestion is that off to the side you let u equal to the uh, numerator and v equal to the denominator. So if u equals to 2x, then u dash equals to 2. And if v equals to x plus 1, then v dash equals to 1. And then we can substitute into our formula v u dash minus u v dash all over v squared. Be careful, if you have two terms, such as the x plus 1, make sure you put it in brackets so you expand the bracket correctly. So we then get x plus 1 times 2 minus 2x times 1 all over x plus 1 squared. Expanding the bracket and then simplifying, we end up with 2 over x plus 1 squared. Now this derivative that we have uh, solved here, we are actually going to use in our second example. Um, where we're going to find the equation of a normal. So please note this. Our second uh, example for this one, for example one, is uh, we let u equal x plus 2, so u dash is 1, and v equals x minus 3, or squared. So you bring the power down the front, which is 2, times by the differential inside, which is 1, so you get 2 outside of the x minus 3, because you lower your power by 1. Substituting into our formula, v u dash minus u v dash all over v squared. Now, uh, for this, we are also going to practice by taking a common factor out. Now, the only common factor is the x minus 3 brackets. So we take x minus 3 out the front of, and then the first term is the 1 outside of x minus 3, and the second term with the minus in between is 2 outside of x plus 2. Notice that that x minus 3 bracket and the x minus 3 to the 4 on the denominator simplify and you're left with just x minus 3 to the power of 3 on the denominator. So expanding what's inside the brackets and collecting like terms, you end up with minus x minus 7 all over x minus 3 or cubed. So for our second example, we're going to find the equation on the normal to the following curve at the point 1, 1. Now, this uh, is the one that we differentiated earlier. So we won't go through the actual differentiation step. So a reminder that the first thing we do is we find the gradient of the tangent when x equals 1. So our derivative from the uh, past example turns out to be 2 over x plus 1 squared. Substitute 1 in there and you get 2 over 4 or a half. Secondly, we find the gradient of the normal, so negative reciprocal, so our gradient of our normal is negative 2. And finally, the equation, well, we know that the gradient of the normal is minus 2, and the point's 1, 1, so substituting that in to y minus y1 equals mx minus x1, we end up with y equals minus 2x plus 3, or in general form, 2x plus y minus 3 equals 0. Thank you.